going to do a real quick uh, video on this 22 CRF 250R. Uh, just doing a service on it right now. About to change the oil, put a new fresh air filter in it. I'm going to go ahead and uh, change the spark plug. But uh, I've also taken apart my fuel tank uh, and fuel pump, removed it. Uh, the things I focus on, on when I get fuel is I just want uh, 93 octane. I try to get at least 93 octane. I don't want to get 89, 87. And I really focus on getting non-ethanol. But uh, so there's one other thing, and I didn't think that much about it with gasoline. I bought a, uh, I don't know if they call it a filter sock, a, a gas tank sock. Anyway, it's made for a KTM. I bought one from my tractor to try to uh, keep all the sediment. And, you know, diesel's a real nasty fuel, but... Uh, I'm gonna start using it on on my gas that I get for my bike as well because I, I watched a lot of uh, sediment and grime following in this tank. And this being a new bike, I just went ahead and pulled it apart and looked at everything, removed that old fuel. But uh, if you don't know about these little, these little old, uh, <clears throat> Alex, I don't know what they call them, Twin Iron makes them. They make them for KTM. They may make them. It's a little, uh, it's a little, I call it a filter sock. If you uh, use it to, uh, when you put your fuel from the tank into your gas jug, uh, it'll catch a lot of that sediment. And uh, I didn't really see nothing wrong. Didn't really see no grime or dirt or nothing. The thing's really clean, but I went ahead and uh, poured all this all out and wiped it all out and, and got it clean. But uh, just uh, something to think about. Uh, like I say, not only the ethanol, but just uh, all, the, all the grit and grime that you'll pick up from these uh, fuel pumps nowadays. And so you don't want that going into the injection system or clogging up something in one of these four strokes because, you know, it costs enough money for every part you buy as it is. But anyway, that's it. I'm going to reassemble this thing and be ready to ride next weekend. There's so much sediment I caught using this little...